Hey guys, Ian Mason here with Fubbo's Thing Break. It's a beautiful morning and I feel great, so I felt like making a video for you guys. And you guys have been asking a lot of questions about uh, blog hosting and how to set up your blog on iPage. So instead of all this boring text under this video, I thought it'd be cool for you guys to watch a video. And uh, I personally find videos much more helpful in terms of learning. So let's go ahead, log into our iPage account. And then you're going to scroll down until you see scripting and add-ons. Click install central. Install central is just a quick note. Install central, you can use it to do one-click installs of a lot of really cool stuff like galleries for photos, forums like uh, PHPBB forum, uh, e-commerce platforms to you know, make your shopping site and connect it with PayPal and all that. Um, content management systems, but um, although there's content management systems here uh, like Joomla, Drupal, and stuff, I personally use WordPress as a content management system. I think it's just really amazing. Uh, it's the most flexible and powerful one. So we're going to install a WordPress blog. <laughs> I can't talk this morning. I'm a little bit tired, but it is beautiful. Uh, WordPress blog. That's what we're going to be doing. So click on WordPress, <laughs> click begin installation, and now we're going to click in blog title, name this whatever you want. I'm, gonna, I'm using a silly domain, um, backflips with Ian, because I recently learned how to do backflips. It's really fun. So backflips with Ian, and put whatever you want for your username and password, and I'll put Ian at backflipswithian.com and in here the path to application area you're going to want to select yes check that box yes install to this directory even if the directory already exists alright and now in database this is the last step uh, you'll just leave it how it is create a database for me automatically of course much more uh, pleasant to have it do it automatically. So, last step, let's click install now. Alright, awesome. So, the install completed pretty quickly and successfully. So, let's check out our new blog based on WordPress. Alright, now, uh, this is the default theme for WordPress. Um, and you can easily customize it. I'll show you how. Uh, let's go quickly into WordPress admin, alright? So you're going to go uh, down here and you're going to click login. See where it says meta? Click login. Enter your username and password that you set uh, when you were installing it. Click login. And now we're going to go to appearance. You can see um, Depending on what theme you have installed, you'll have different options here in the appearance area. Some of them have some pretty advanced options, others uh, don't have any. But this theme that comes with WordPress by default has some settings for widgets, um, menus, you know, your links on your site, uh, the header image, um, you know, like this image of the trees that's a header. You can change that very easily. Uh, let's, let's try that. They have a few that are available by default. So, um, ooh, cherry blossoms. Uh, very predictable. <laughs> I'm in Korea, so of course I like cherry, cherry blossoms. Where is that? I don't see that picture. Oh, there. Okay, cherry blossoms. I like that. So let's click Save Changes. Of course, you can use your own image and customize and all that. We'll show you in other tutorials, getting more in depth, how to do that. Well, that's really beautiful. Um, all right. Also, there's a you know a bunch of tutorials on our site, web hosting break, on how to make your first post in in WordPress and how to uh, edit a post, how to add pages, how to do everything. You know, we're covering it all, and it's all free. And uh, just let me know if you got any questions. Uh, this has been a quick tutorial on how to set up your blog on iPage web hosting in just a few clicks. It's really easy. It 
It's fast, and uh, I recommend it for anybody who doesn't want to get overwhelmed by unnecessary technical stuff. Um, I know I actually used to spend about 20 or 30 minutes manually setting up blogs and WordPress based sites before I knew about this automated stuff. So it's been really helpful to me because I have a lot of websites. I've got like 150 of them now. Um, so like I said, let me know if you got any questions. Uh, it's been fun making this video and uh, I got more coming soon. And uh, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later. Peace.